everyone this is Michelle welcome back to my channel if you like my video hit the like button if you wish to subscribe hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos so I know I told you guys yesterday that I was going to do a rune card video and I was going to upload it and make it schedule it to be released well unfortunately I didn't get around to doing that um this okay so the holiday season is about getting close to one week in. And I have been working a lot. Uh, my I got paid today. By the way, um, my statues did not come in today, so you're not going to get, you're not going to see the statues today. I'm hoping and praying they will come in tomorrow. Because I really would like for you to see them and all that wonderful stuff. So, hopefully they will arrive tomorrow. When they do, I will be here to get them. Which I am just really excited about We're going to be getting them and everything. So, um, about five months ago, or no, to back, about six about half a year ago, half a year ago, like six, six and a half, maybe seven months, I had ordered some things off of Amazon. It was a cartouche. Uh, this was a piece of jewelry that is Egyptian, um, but I wanted it because I had always wanted one ever since I was a little girl when I was in elementary school. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was elementary school. My drama teacher actually had a cartouche, her and her husband. I don't know if she's dead or alive or, her, or they're divorced or whatever but at the time that I saw it they were married they had gone to Egypt for a visit and he had gotten her a cartouche with her name and hieroglyphics I wanted one and I made a vow that it didn't matter how long it took I was actually going to buy a cartouche cartouches were really big in the 90s and for people that were born after 9-11, the 90s was a period of time between the 80s and the new century. I know it's people say, we know this already. <laughs> but just so people know what the 90s were, the they were really popular in the 90s. Everybody wanted a cartouche necklace. In fact, they were, in fact, uh, they were actually in catalogs where you could order it and have it delivered or you know and all that so were beetles a uh, little scarab beetle jewelry was really popular in the 90s uh, there was actually a bracelet i saw at a jewelry store back in the 90s that were scarabs and i could never afford to buy one because at the time i didn't have a job and also i didn't have i wasn't i wasn't old enough to have a job yeah it's, it's one of those periods of times when you're when you have to be relying on your uh, parents for everything. So back in May, um, I ordered my cartouche and I had, uh, I didn't know what we were moving or anything. And so what happened was when we were about ready to move, and my stuff still, my stuff had not yet reached. I think, I think one of the items was in California at the time. I had put a hold on my mail. And I thought, okay, this is really simple. I'm just going to be able to go over there and pick up the packages. No problem. Well, it ended up becoming a problem. I was not able to get to the post office to pick up my packages. And I'm going to tell you something. When you have packages in the mail and you can't get them it gets really annoying so when I got home I thought that my brother had meant that my statues were in so I was like okay great when I get home I'm gonna do this video showing my statues off it actually turned out to be the packages that were actually on hold at the post office I was starting to get things I had gotten um so I can Find it. This is why I put those things um, those things on the wall. That's, oh, here it is. Oh. 
So this was another, this is one of the objects that came in. Um, this is actually going to go on my wall. So this is, this was something that came in a couple of days ago. This was one of the items that, um, was on hold because I had moved. So, um, so in the, so this video, I'm going to show you, uh, some of the things, well, all the things that I got in today. And these are all items I ordered like seven, eight months ago that finally arrived here. So I'm going to take this off. So this is my cartouche. This is what I had been wanting for years. that right here. Oh, come on. Yeah. Oh, better yet, I'm going to put up against something. Alright. Oh, this works. Because I just want you to see how really beautiful this is, so. That's my name in hieroglyphics, and uh, I love it. Um, like I said, this is something I had been wanting for a very long time, and now I own it. So, um, so, very happy about that. Um. Okay, so that came in. Another thing that came in today, now this was a item that I actually got a refund for because um, because they had failed to deliver this on time. So this is the Victorian Steampunk Tarot. This is a very battered box. I mean, really battered box. But... It has the book, and I really like the full-colored um, illustrations inside. Um, these have not been taken out of their buying their thing, so little, you know. So. So, the, this is the back of the card. This is just bizarre. This is the front of the card. Um, I'm going to actually show you each of these cards because I don't have to worry about making this into a two-parter. So, alright, so this is, so the card stock is not really good. It's kind of flimsy, but, um, but compared to my Modern Witch Tarot deck, uh, these look like they can be shuffable. So, um, this is the uh, Night Night of Moths. I'm just going to stick this up. The Page of Moths. The Ten of Moths. The Nine of Moths, the Eight of Moths, Seven of Moths, the Six of Moths, <clears throat> the Five of Moths. Four of Moths, the Three of Moths, the Two of Moths, the Ace of Moths. Okay, so the Moths represent um, the Wands in the Tarot deck. 
Okay. Now this is the bees. This is the representation of the swords. So this is the king of bees. The queen of bees. I'm really hoping that uh, that repair guy doesn't show up. Because I really would hate to have to redo this video. The knight of bees. The page of bees. That's interesting. The ten of bees. Or the ten of swords. The nine of bees. The ten of bees. The seven of bees. The six of bees, which is cool. They have this little hand. The five of bees. Four of bees. The three of bees. The two of bees. And the ace of bees. Now the next one is the king of beetles. This rep is a representation of the coins. So here is the king of beetles. The queen of beetles. The Knight of Beetles. The Page of Beetles. The Ten of Beetles. The Nine of Beetles. The Eight of Beetles. The seven of beetles, the six of beetles, the five of beetles, the four of beetles, the three of beetles, the two of beetles. All right. All right. And then these right here, all right, Okay. I'm so I'm looking for the ace of beetles. A second here. Okay. 
All right. That's weird. So these were actually, this is the Ace, King, and Queen of Moths. So. So. Yeah. Just show them to you. Queen. The King. And the Ace. So, we'll just look at this. Alright. Let's All right, so apparently the ace is uh, not where it generally is. So yeah, these, this entire suit is um, is where it's supposed to be. Okay, so the final one is, of course, um, the cups, which is in the form of moths. But they have the they have they make they make sure that you know what suit it is. So this is um, the ace. King, um, Queen, Knight, Page, Ten of these are all these are dragonflies. So this is the ten of dragonflies. Uh, nine, eight, uh, seven, six, five. Four, three, and two. All right. Okay, so those are the minor arcani. Now we're going to go through the major. Now these are really beautiful. I really do like these. So we'll start off. You have the Fool, the Magician, the High Priestess, the Empress, which is, oh, this is just really beautiful, the Emperor. The High Priest, the Lovers, this is interesting, this is the Fly Machine, I think this might be the Chariot. And you have uh, strength. You have the hermit. The wheel of fortune. Justice. The 
hey man. Deaf, which is interesting. Temperance. The Devil card. Tower. Very, 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 um, nasty card. It could also give you the impression that the tower card is a bad card just by how violent the picture looks. The star. The moon. The sun. Judgment in the world. All right. So that is the entire deck of cards. Um, so that is the other thing that came in for me that I had been waiting like seven, eight months for. But um, I don't really have a uh, opinion about the deck. Uh, I did say I was not going to buy another deck of cards, but because I had already bought these months and months in advance, these don't actually qualify as me actually breaking my vow to not buy more tarot cards. Now, the next item that came in today was something that I had to get because if I didn't get it, um, I couldn't work. So... There is a store over there in Europe that is makes um, they have tea, they do T-shirts and they do all these different types of things, and I was actually looking for Norse themed face masks because of my job, and I was also getting really um, sick and tired of face masks that pinch my ears. Uh, like for example, is I can find it here. Um, this face mask here, which I do love it immensely. I do love it. Um, when you put it over your mouth, you have to loop it. Um, when you wear this for um, eight hours, and I'm not talking about, I mean, that includes um, when you're prepping. It really hurts the inside of your ear, the earlobe right here, because it's constantly rubbing up against it. So I was looking for something that I would like wearing to work um, and definitely did echo uh, my beliefs and everything. So I actually found this. So you'd like that? Uh, just, I'm going to lower it down here. So. Now it doesn't go to lower. Oh! It came off. So. I don't have to do this. I don't know what happened during the whole thing with the shipping, but, um, yeah, this keeps popping off. Back where it belongs. Okay. 
There we go. All right, so it's currently where it needs to be. All right. Yeah, so um, this is what it looks like. I got um, Odin's Raven. And then you do like this. Yeah. So. Yeah, it's probably on back. It's probably on crooked. Oh. <sighs> but yeah. So. I bought it, and uh, oh. I bought it because I needed a mask that And then has the filter. And it just it snaps in place once you get it to snap. So, this. <sighs> this one snap. Might be because it's not positioned correctly. Well, anyways, um, so got the mask. I'll 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 bother with it later. But um, yeah, so um, you can breathe through it, and it's got it's got the strap. That keeps it from basically rail, basically not railroading. Sorry, basically um, it keeps my it keeps it on, but it also enables me to um, not have to worry about it doing that. But yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna mess with this for a while, get a snap back in place. But yeah, so um, I'm gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and until next time. May you be happy, healthy, most importantly be safe, and hell to the gods. Bye.